everyone welcome to my youtube channel so in this particular video i'll talk about that what other skills are required apart from the technical skills in order to go into a data, data science domain you know this question have been asked from me a lot of times uh, you know in the linkedin chat by the students what do you think what is your answer what do you think is the uh, skill which is required apart from you know the technical skill i have already created a video for that and i am expecting that you already have watched that video the only key skill which i usually say is the storytelling skill so basically if you will observe here that uh, whenever you are you are talking with an interviewer suppose you are giving an interview to switch your company whenever you are talking about the project that you have done in data science domain it's all about that how basically you're telling the story because that obviously generates the interest to the interviewer or any xyz client for whom you are doing the project inside the company right so it's not about the code development that you did it's not about that everyone will be able to understand your key terms related to sklearn tensorflow pytorch no everyone is not a data scientist here right but can you able to convey your problem what challenges you have faced what things you have done in order to you know optimize the results in a layman manner so that anyone who is not from this domain also will be able to understand what you are conveying here in order to you know good be good in this particular skill what you can do maybe you can talk with the, with your friends and talk about the problem statement talk about the solution to whom who are not in this domain and verify check that whether those people are easily able to understand the key terms which you are talking about here or not i have seen a lot of my friends who are really good you know in development part they are really excellent no one can compete to them but when the explanation part comes when when my professor usually says that please explain this to that particular student they fail there they are not able to explain their project in a proper manner they lack that communication part there i think that is one of the most important skill which is quite really important at least in this domain apart from the technical skills that you have technicality wise it's it's a continuous learning right it's like today there is something tomorrow a new research is happening you have to learn on a daily basis but what apart from this you develop the things you build the things properly you know how you can do that you are on the pace you are you are doing a continuous learning but are you able to explain those concepts to the other person or not in a layman manner so that anyone who is not from a data science domain also will be clearly able to understand what you want to convey here i hope i'm making sense to everyone so in order to you know uh, excel in this particular skill try to you know connect with many people and try to explain your projects in such a way that they will be easily able to understand that initially you might be shy initially you might face some trouble also but believe me after doing this in not n number of times you will be easily able to do that as well for me if i'll talk about myself i i used to be teaching domain from past 2 years and that thing really helps me a lot in terms of the communication part by saying communication i am not saying that my grammatical things are very good no but i can explain the things in a manner so that the student who is not from this domain also will be easily able to understand what i did in my project what is my objective how basically i build that product that is something which i am saying to you all also to have that particular skill so i hope that you will be able to get my idea what i want to convey here and with this i would like to end this particular video hope you really enjoyed this video and i'll see you all in my next upcoming video